recording. All right, I've been working on the frill here on the Triceratops, and I've exposed the outer edge today, and uh, you can see the epoxipitals. We'll get a little closer look, but you can see from overhead all the cracks we've done a light blasting off and added Vinac to the surface and CA to all the cracks and getting it really stabilized and then we can go back through and do heavy cleaning. Alright, we're going to get a close look at the epoxipitals. Here in the drawing you can see the epoxipitals line the outer edge of the frill and they're triangular in shape and uh, sometimes triceratops have them or they don't or they're fused on or they're loose so uh, we'll go right above it here on the frill and here's an epoxipital right here and you can see the uh, fusion line but you can still see it's open a bit you can see the triangular shape and next to it there's a start of another one and up here is a really big one it goes from here all the way over to here and it's mostly fused on and then the one next to it is a little broken but you can see the fusion is almost totally complete you can't see a division between the epoxipital and the frill and we go to the next one and here it is right here and this one again is totally fused you can see blood grooves going from the frill into the epoxipital so it's completely uh, attached to the frill bone and coming around and there doesn't seem to be one here so we'll have to figure out what's going on there and I gotta keep going all the way down 